been a long time since we flew uh, the J-21. I was surprised I queued up so quick. with this plane is it overheats so quickly you want to use prop pitch of 85 maybe 80 and we need to side climb a decent energy fighter. You don't want to be doing like extensive dives in this because the dive speed is, is relatively low. Germany. No one else is side climbing. Assigned squad mate. I'm trying to, I'm trying to bug people. I'm trying to like throw advice to them, hoping that someone will listen, but. One, two, there's, maybe, there's three people side climbing, that's it. These guys, I don't consider that side climbing. Need to be outside of the bases, side climbing. And they can fucking get owned. There's three bombers up top. Air target belts for both uh, pairs, uh, both sets of guns. And we were gonna turn in, but they've already got the F 109 and the key 60. That key 61 is a bit dangerous. Zeroes up top. We're gonna stay back here and continue to try and climb. Hopefully those guys will start diving since all of our team is down low. Where's that spit? There he is. I think he's on fire. Yeah, 
we're not going to go down low. This battle's going to be with those guys. So there's one, two, three, four over there. They've lost three already. That's not bad. We've only lost one so far. Someone takes care of that key sixty one. With the exception of that guy, we're the highest. Hoping that he doesn't see us. Oh, he's level six. Oh shit. Somebody him. We might have to dart down and get those guys. Right now we've got the altitude. Actually, I think we're good. Four, five. We've got still three unaccounted for. That's six. Two unaccounted for right now. One unaccounted for. Seven. This is good. Now we just need to be careful on how we boom. Oh, there they are. They're all here. right I can line these guys up if he doesn't see me yeah we couldn't go down fast Wasn't bad. Did he turn away? No, he. I have to watch that guy.
dang. That's why our team sucked. Started out good. But we can finish this. I need to know who's flying what. It's key 61. Then the boomer guy is 129. So a key 61, a 0, and a 129. be leading Where are you going?
Oh wow. Another ace. That worked out well. Long game. Maybe half an hour game. A little under half an hour. I was due for fuel soon. I misjudged. Um, what happened to the guy in, that was in the key 61? I thought there was a guy in a key. That guy. Where did he go? Okay, he must have died up here. What the fuck? We see him get a kill, so he could have got he could have got this kill after he died. Did he J out? He died. Just doesn't maybe I'm overlooking him. I want to say we can figure it out later, but I know what's going to happen. I'm going to end up closing this window, forgetting that I want to look at it later. But yeah, you know what? We'll, let's, let's discuss this. So this is our third ace in this plane. Um, it's been a while since I flew this out because I'm impatient when it comes to matchmaking. And I don't want to sit waiting in the queue three and three plus minutes for a match. Um, that's that's not me I know it's not a long time in the scheme of things I said three plus so three and on five minutes um, so my teammate he didn't get any kills he got two assists and he got four ground kills but he should not have I told I tried to warn him that he was level 100 and I told him to be careful and I knew that he was going to head on that guy. I just saw it. I was trying to rush down there to help. And if he would have done it right, he could have out dog fight dog fought that uh that one two nine. But he tried to head on. Um, I guess he didn't anticipate. You know, I, he probably thought it was a bomber. And oh, this is an easy kill. No, it's got it's got pretty good uh front guns, which is why which is why you saw me stalling him. And there was nothing he could do him being a level 100 and all but what I did not do was I looked and saw that he was level 100 who was he again it was boomer so he's he's got a fair amount he's got far more 
uh, RB experience than I do. He's been playing longer, at least. Um, I've been playing RB, dedicated RB, for maybe a year. It'll be a year in March, I believe. Um, he's got far more experience in RB than than AB. I've certainly been in the game, been playing the game longer than him. I'm almost certain of it, just by looking at uh, both of these. Now he's got a little bit of time in sim. Uh, but let's look at... No, not really impressed here. Let me guess, he's got, f he's been doing a lot of ground, no? Oh, that's right, we're looking in the wrong damn thing here. There you go, this looks a little bit better. I am actually impressed. Every single one of these planes on the first page at least are, well, there's one. For the most part, he's not upside down. There's another one. But it, they're, I mean, they're almost one-to-one -one when they're, when he's upside down. So it's like, I mean, they're good. Okay. So, I did not expect an ace match in this match. Um, there was a long wagon train, and I was trying to take advantage of it, but two of those planes saw me coming and they might have called them out called me out to their teammates because uh, as I was trying to uh, come up behind that that wagon train of uh, enemy planes you could see one pull off and then they you know one by one they started kind of spreading out a little bit and I'm like shit so I went and ran up on this guy first level 16 He took a, well, I mean, I was going to say he took a long time to die, but he was flying a dead plane for a while. Uh, it wasn't really maneuverable, though, because I guess my worry was, okay, well, I, I kept seeing him on the uh, mini-map, and I'm like, I don't want him sneaking up on me and, and killing me when he's dead uh, or damaging me. So this guy here, oh, wow, he uh, he's a level 39. Got the top score on this team. And I almost let this guy go because I wanted to go in and kill this guy and help my teammate, but I didn't want him breaking off away and me not being able to find him and he's making the uh the tickets run down because he's a bomber. So I went ahead and got him first. And that was this guy level 30 there's nothing he could do he started shooting at me and I was hoping that I wouldn't take damage um, the J21 is somewhat robust doesn't catch fire as easily as as, as a lot of planes um, and then there was this guy here uh, my teammate was kind of setting him up I'm not sure if he I think he saw me but there wasn't really much he could do and he was flying like he wasn't a level 100 I'm almost certain he was not no he wasn't zeros fighting zeros are scary unless you have a massive energy advantage then they're not gonna be able to do much uh, even when they're down low or when they have lots of energy they're not really energy fighters they're, they're turn fighters so uh, once you get them down to the ground, they can't do much. Um, and if they're slow, they can't really do much. Um, they can only dodge so long. I mean, when you boom and zoom, you can do it infinitely. And uh, as they dodge, they burn energy and they have to work lower. You know, they have to trade altitude for energy to kind of balance things out. But they're losing that, that, that potential energy each time they dive down. 
if you don't allow them to climb back up, eventually they're going to run out of altitude, which means they're going to run out of energy. So, um, and then there's the boomer guy. Uh, we got him. Um, again, I don't know what my teammate was thinking. I think I looked at his rank already. For someone who didn't get any any solid kills, he ended up being third on the team probably because of this. And two of these equals, use, I would say they equal one kill, two assists. It's like half kills. Um, so he's level 30. Um, and then there was a dialogue here of, um, so let, let, let me kind of quickly describe this. So initially I noticed that people weren't side climbing. I'm like, damn, this is going to be a quick match. Hardly anyone side climbing. And of course, the only two people who were left were the ones who side climbed. It was me and the, the and this guy. We were both side climbing, um, and he must have taken damage because he or ran out of ammo because he went back to the base, um, and either repaired, rearmed, or refueled, um, and then he came back up. And then for a while there, we were together, but he wasn't climbing enough to my liking. Um, now he can probably get away with it because he's a spitfire, you know, he's, he's maneuverable. But remember, we were fighting against zeros and, you know, the, there was the key 61 as well. And I still don't know how he died. Um, so I decided to kind of shadow him, but I was going to climb. And so, uh, I was climbing because at first I saw the Sidon guy and the... It was one of the the A7s, uh, the A6s. Um, it was this guy. I remember seeing them up top. They were at like 5,000 meters, and that's when we turned back to the base to kind of, I guess, extend away a bit. Um, then I lost them, so I don't know what happened to this guy. And so I kept climbing up, and I went up all to probably. 7,000 meters because I thought that he was going to show up. I thought that he he was going to keep climbing and be above me. Um, key 61s can be nasty. Um, they don't have uh, good guns, at least the lower uh, tier ones. Um, but they have decent climb rate and they're somewhat fast. Um, so so I didn't want to get caught out with that, you know, uh, against that plane. Uh, they are very maneuverable. Um, they got strong elevator, I believe, um, but they do not take damage well. So you got to make it count because once they get behind you, it's hard to kind of get them off of your tail, especially in a plane like this. So um, back to chat here. Um, lost the dots, and then this guy says, attack the ground target, and then I'm like, what the hell? I was like, no, dude. I was like, don't do that, especially when you know that there's one zero, there's at least a zero, and a uh, and a key 61 left. You dive down and get targets, and the next thing you know, you're getting bum rushed. Especially if it's a zero, you don't want a zero behind you. You don't want a key 61 behind you, but a zero is doubly nasty. Um, so, so you know, I explained, okay, well, no, you know, don't do that. They'll get you if you do. Uh, I said, play the long game, unless they're lower than you. If you know they're lower than you, then then you're good to go. And then I I, I was still thinking about the key 61, so I said, check base, because I already knew. So we, uh, I knew that I could see the, uh, the, the HE 111 and the A6M2, and I was still looking for that other guy. I was looking for the, the key 61. So I was like, check the base. I didn't even think about the uh, the one two nine, and so I was, I, you know, I was looking for, uh, I was looking for the other one while <clears throat> my teammate was fighting the zero. Um, and so after I killed H one eleven, I told him I was going to come and help him. I think he would have been okay for a while. The zero was chasing him, and then 
my teammate once he saw me coming he turned back and was was trying to I guess to put him in a compromising position or get the kill and so we uh, uh <clears throat> we killed him and then my teammate decided to go for the ground targets and I think he would have been fine uh, because the the 129 would have had a hard time getting him he could have dodged out of the way and kept doing it but for some reason he went for the head on and, and lost his plane because of it even after me warning him you know okay be careful he's level 100 I should have I should have reminded him okay well uh, the 129 has a uh, has pretty good front guns I think it has uh, uh, MG 151s I think a pair of them and maybe some uh, uh, some machine guns I'm not sure um, but yeah the <clears throat> after my teammate died this guy was he was either trying to bait me or was trying to set me up to turn into me um, thinking that okay well he's gonna come and he's gonna have a massive amount of uh, of energy and not be able to turn well or um, I was gonna try and turn with him and initially he might get the better of me um, but I, you know I'm not the typical uh, level 100 you know so I'm sitting there I'm j I'm just flying around and m making him burn his his energy because it, he was trying to he looked like he was setting up setting up a pitch up like the and trying to entice me to head on with him and I'm like no nah, I'm not gonna do that I'm gonna wait until I'm behind you and you can't do anything else and so we just played this positioning battle for our probably about 60 seconds until it was like there was nothing else he could do and I think he just gave up but yeah that it was a it was an awesome uh, match highlight match good game